Next thing I want to do is I want to uh, to address I want to address the issue of uh, locks. This system does not work if it uh, if there are multiple locks on the door. It does not. It just doesn't work. So if I were to unlock one door, uh, one lock. So to fix that. We, uh, to f in fact, this is such a simple fix that I feel really stupid if we're not knowing how to do this when, if we're not knowing that this could be, that this could be done when, uh, when I first made this. So, so in the key blueprint, uh, you do not need to, uh, to, like, set the door variable to nothing and then is locked and blah, 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 blah. All you have to do is set simulate physics to true. Set can set and then set can pick up to true. That's all you have to do. And then in here, you can just get rid of all of this. You could just get rid of that. And we'll do a... There it is. It's simulating physics right here. This is the node that you'll be needing for this. And we'll just do a branch here. Off of the is valid. That is locked. No. That is locked. There we go. If simulating physics is false and the door is valid, then that could only mean that it is currently locked uh, on the door. So, we'll want it to constantly be setting is locked to true. Otherwise, we'll do a do once... Well, I want to do a do once node, and don't forget to make it reset the do once when it, when it is not simulating physics. And uh, off of here, we'll do the exact same thing we did, the chair, did with the chair. Uh, at, make it attempt to set to set uh, is locked to false, and then here is when you would uh, set the door variable to nothing. That is when you would do it. Now, can't open the door. Unlock that one. Oops! Still can't open the door. And I can pick that up and drop it and everything. I can pick that up, drop it, everything. But once I unlock this one, hooray! And just like that, I can still open the door if I pick up and drop the lock, blah, blah, blah. There we go. That This is the whole system. This is the whole system. Literally just check if the lock is simulating physics and if the door variable is valid and all of that that is, this is the entire system and i feel so stupid that i o that i overcomplicated this it is not complicated at all that is literally all you need to do